Hi, I'm Jim Janoski. How do you propagate plants? Well, plants propagate themselves through structures that we know to be flowers. In this begonia, we have a very nice flower set, and at the base of these flowers, we have developing seed. Now, the plant eventually will shed these flowers, and the seed will grow on their own. Or we can harvest the seed and dry them down and eventually germinate them in a germinating mix in the greenhouse or outside. Here we have another plant, a fig plant, that has some nice figs on it and they came from coverings over the seed which came from a flower, a fig flower, several months ago. Again, the flower forms and then a covering over the flower produces a fruit. Tomatoes, we all know what tomatoes look like inside and out. We have seed covered by a fleshy fruit which we enjoy in the summertime. These seeds can be saved and germinated uh, if they're not hybrid varieties. It's easiest to propagate plants by seed if you buy seed from seed catalogs, pre-packaged small amounts of seeds, very easy to grow, germinate them in a germinating mix. Here we have one more example of a flower, a moon vine flower, which is kind of a little bit old, but at the base the seeds are developing, and eventually the fruit in this case, although we really wouldn't think of it as fruit, would be a spiny covering which protects the seeds. Seed propagation and horticultural topics enroll in our horticulture courses at National State Community College.